Hi. What's the plan? That was all. Got it. Something I can help you with? What's the story with this place? Well, for starters, my name's Chuck. Chuck Finley. Part of a group of outcasts from the Brotherhood of Steel. We're from the D.C. area. And this bunker is our home in the Commonwealth. You're in charge? Me? Oh, hell no. I might be the oldest, but no one's actually really in charge. You know, we came from a strict hierarchy with the Brotherhood of Steel, and we all saw how great that turned out. The chain of command was so inefficient it would get us all killed if we tried that bullshit here. We're a small enough group, and we don't need a formal hierarchy fucking us up. Why did you leave the Brotherhood in the first place? It's complicated, but the short version is, the Brotherhood of Steel started out on the West Coast, shortly after the Great War, and its original mission was to hoard pre-war technology. A little over 30 years ago, the Brotherhood sent a group east to explore. And, well, that group eventually settled in the D.C. wasteland, which is where most of the crew here grew up. Our leader was a man named Owen Lyons. So, in addition to acquiring technology, Lyons believed it was important to be a good neighbor and help out the local community, which eventually didn't sit well with... You see, we were involved in a massive project. Over time, more uh -huh. than Owen Lyons... A few years passed and there was a power struggle and ultimately our choice are to leave for most people stay we that was four years ago. I wanted to ask you about something else okay shoot how can I get in well obviously we don't let just anyone in the only reason you made it through the front door is our scouts spotted you a mile away and radioed in that you matched a description of the person who's been taking out raiders lately. So we turned off the turrets and figured we'd give you an audience. We work on a you scratch my back, I'll scratch your system here. If you want in, you gotta do something for us first. Maybe later. I have some things I have to take care of. Understood. Good luck out there. Don't have the key. Can't pick this. Excuse me. Hey there. Something I can help you with? How can I... Well, obviously... Who's been... We work on a... Mm -hmm. So, what did you have in mind? Right? One of our uh -huh. any techs never re uh -huh. one of the get to the point. Get to the point. What? What do you need? Right. Uh, I think the last. Anyway, head up. Bring the weapon back to me. Come on, let me in. No deal. You help us, we. Okay. I'll help you. All right. I'll uh, mark the location of the church on your map.
What's on your mind? Thanks for finally showing. The bathroom is downstairs. It's been out of order since we first opened. It looks like most of the pipes are gonna need replacement. Folks around here are getting fed up about heading outside each time to do their business. Last week, one of our guys, little Joey, had it outside to take a shit. Then a devil showed up and tore him a new one. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I never really liked Joey. But, as you can probably imagine, incidents like that aren't uh, particularly good for business. If you know what I mean. Anyways, glad you're here. It'll be nice to get this place fully operational. So, you need anything before getting started? Tell me about yourself. My name is Sam. Sam Krul. I'm originally from Sweden. My family got pretty bad over there when I was a kid. So my family took a boat to the States. If they'd known in advance how brutal life in the Commonwealth could be, I, uh, I doubt we would have made the same choice. They were killed in a super mutant raid when I was 13. We ran with this gang ever since. It's my job to keep tabs on settlements and other raiding groups in these parts. Got a network of informants I used to keep our guys uh, busy. Also useful when you need to find a plumber. What's the story with this place? Never been to a raider bar before, huh? We used to hang out over at Club Fusion, but we got banned. A bunch of over sensitive cunts running that place. So, we hang out here now. If you ask me, we're better off. Just looking for something. And I'm betting you know right where to find it. Check with Vadova, downstairs. He sells weapons and armor. Also some weird shit, so I uh, tried not to ask too many questions. <laughs> it's worth talking to if it's any goods you want to fence, but uh, don't let the cheerful demeanor fool you. He's a stone cold killer. You get on his bad side, he won't just kill you, he'll fuck your corpse. And worst part, you won't even cuddle with it afterwards. <laughs> Hey there. Hey, hey, sexy bees. What's the story with this place? A few months back, the raiders were causing too many problems at Club Fusion, so Fusion City implemented various security measures to keep them out. But that didn't change the fact that raiders still need a place to get drunk, let loose, and stare at titties all night. So I set up shop here and opened a raider bar. You're in charge? Yeah, I run the place. What kinds of things do you sell? Almost anything and everything I could get my hands on. Rare artifacts, bloody outfits, you name it. Nice to meet a friendly face. Probably not what you expected walking into a raider bar, huh? I wanted to ask you about something else. Okay. I'm looking around for something, and I'm betting you know right where to find it. Here you go. Check it out. Oh, we yeah, had a sledgehammer. I have that. The sledgehammer isn't for sale, though. Please. I was told you could help me. Tell you what. There's another weapon I'm trying to acquire. Track it down for me, and I'll trade you the sledgehammer for it. Okay, I'm, I'm listening. The weapon I'm looking for is a dildo bat. About a month ago, some guy walked in here desperate for caps and pawned off a bunch of stuff. It was mostly low-value stuff, so I didn't think to examine the dodo bat carefully. I sold the bat to a guy named Will for 20 caps, 
A couple days later, another customer comes in asking for the bat. Of course, I ask him why on earth would he want to buy a dodo bat? He says because there's a treasure map hidden in the tip. I asked him what the map was too, and after some convincing, he confessed it was the map and access codes to the treasure of Jamaica Plain. Wait, were you just playing a joke on me? If we could find the treasure of Jamaica Plain, that would get this place fully operational. So what do you think? Are you up for tracking down that dodo bat? Sure, why not? Not like I have anything better to do. The guy I sold the bat to lives in the bus just north of Fort Hagen Red Rocket. Good luck out there. Hey there. Any luck tracking down that dodo bat? Any luck tracking down that Detected. Curious. Hostile sensor meeting detected.
Nice. Take a look. 